Hello, my name is Jeff Goebel. It is day 47. Today was a holiday Monday in Ontario. And uh, so I was out with some friends on adventures and then my monthly All You Can Eat Fajita Monday event, which I um, have once a month where I get together friends that friends of mine that don't know each other and we talk about different things. It's kind of a social event I've been doing for three years now. But today I want to just quickly talk about YouTube videos and I'm not an expert. I'm only on day 47 of creating these. But I want to say it's an interesting phenomenon. There are a few people who are watching these videos daily and I know about them because they like content or they plus one it on Google or they reply. They make a comment. And then there are a few other people that are watching them in binges, you know, now and then. And there are a few strangers watching them referrals from giveit100.com who might watch a specific day. And I understand very few people are going to watch all these because most of them are boring. I don't have content yet. I'm just talking to the camera on my own personal journey of becoming a YouTube personality eventually, but currently working on a job search project which isn't really going well. So 47 days of a job search project where I've done maybe two hours work <laughs> in 47 days. But the interesting thing is, I really love it when somebody comments and nobody comments. And that was really the thing that I most feared. For two years, I didn't make a single YouTube video because I was terrified that people would comment and I would be crushed or hurt or devastated. And now that no one's commenting, it's worse. I can imagine, I never did stand-up comedy, but I thought about it. I wrote a few routines, and a lot of people said to me, oh, you should be a stand-up comedian. You know, you hear that. But I couldn't stand the idea of standing up and having people not laugh in the audience. It just, that fear was big enough to stop me from doing it. And when I talk into the camera, there is no audience. It's like a, um, well, it's, it's like nothing, really. There's no, there's nothing else I know of where I talk to a person that isn't there and never get a response. And it's weird. I wish people would. <laughs> when I watch other people's videos and I have a, a like for it or a comment, they inspire me. I need to respond. And sometimes I respond, I think it's too much. I'm responding to, to one lady. Almost every video I watch, I have a comment. And it, it kind of incomprehensible, oh, that's not the right word, incomprehensible, no, I can't conceive how people can watch a video, even a boring video, and not have some sort of a comment, and maybe not every day, but I've got 47, I've got over 50 videos, I don't even know how many I have, and three people have commented, one occasionally, you know, the same person, it's weird. Anyway, I'm not asking, I'm not begging for comments. I'm just saying it's an interesting phenomenon that I have chosen to talk into the camera with no audience and no response, and yet I still feel like I've got to do it every day. You know, it's 10 p.m. at night. I had an active day. I could have gone to bed. Still got to read my Facebook, but I didn't have to send this. And yet, sending it, the journey is as much for me as anyone else, but it would be nice occasionally do you see a comment. <laughs> now I feel like oh, I shouldn't say that. It's like begging. It. My brain floods with the negative thoughts again. Anyway, sorry. Comment, don't comment. I'm not... <laughs> uh, do I save it? Well, anyway. Hi, my name is Jeff Goble. Thanks, uh, thanks for watching my journey. Thanks for watching me on Frogstar TV. <laughs>